Hello everybody, happy Thursday. Okay, we are getting started right away today. So, I I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm giddy. I'm super giddy that my piece of cake bundle is back in stock and that I can play. And I will be, ha ha. So this was another fun one I did. Um, I'm gonna show you a little technique too while we're doing this one tonight. So um, if you had missed this, this one is in the occasions catalog, but had been so popular that it was kind of out of stock for a while and is now back in, okay? So we are starting off with a piece of Whisper White cardstock, regular, you know, eight and a half, oh, sorry, yeah, eight and a half, five and a half, scored at four and a quarter. I had to think there. Did you like that? I'm like, I can't even remember my measurements. Then we've got a little of the Share What You Love DSP. I have cut this to four inches by one and three quarters. I've got another, hello, Jeanette, another Whisper White that's four by five and a quarter. I've got a couple of little scraps of basic black that are four inches wide. You'll see why when we get there. And then I've pre-cut, hey, hey, lady, hi, Denise. I've pre-cut a little stitched oval and then a coordinating layering black circle. Okay, you ready? So those bits we can put aside with the exception of, I'm going to steal just this piece here. Now, I know I haven't got to see you on here live in forever. I've actually, I'm in my pajamas. I'm, I've just showered and got back in my pajamas. I am not feeling so hot today. Um, no, it is not a piece of kale. Ha ha, Laura. Laura busted eyed me. I had a spelling mistake on my post and it said about the piece of kale bundle. Yes, good night. Who wants kale? So, okay, if you missed this, this adorable embossing folder, which is our confetti embossing folder, is actually one of the freebies you can get right now during celebration. So with a $60 purchase, you can grab this, okay? So I was like, hey, piece of cake, confetti, woo woo. You just got off work because I can't sell to me. <laughs> Tell your husband that great. Just kidding. Um, okay, so we've got our super cute little confetti embossing folder. Um, and what we're going to do with that is we're going to run it through the Big Shot, but I want you to listen carefully. So this is not your usual Big Shot folder, right? They're the big, thick ones. Hello, Anna. And so the textured impressions embossing folders, which are the ones that make it super realistic, you got to put through a little bit differently. So you want your Big Shot platform. And you want your folder with the crease side going into the machine because that way as it pushes, it releases pressure out the back end. I'm not even going there, Laura. We're not talking about it. Tell him to stop being cheeky. I can already anticipate what he is saying about releasing pressure out the back end. Okay, good. Ta-da. So we have got that. Look at that. Can you see that? Like, do you see the super cute little confetti on there? Woo woo adorable okay so let's take that one and remember free 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 that one is on during celebration so you've got another like what is it i don't even know the date today what's the date it's spring break i don't know the date 10 days okay so we got that one and next thing we're going to do is we're going to go back to our little stamp set okay now we need to pick i need to pick a cake i'm just going to put that on it so maybe I don't know, maybe baby. Okay, we're gonna go with this. We're gonna go with this guy because he's cute. Okay, so let's grab you. I'm gonna slap you on a block. And then this one, I think, I'm trying to decide what I wanna do here. Let's see, okay. I'm gonna stamp it in a color. If it doesn't work, well, whatever. You've been there with me before where I've had to redo things. So it's not like it's gonna be anything new if I schmuck it up. So we're gonna come in with this and we'll do you. Okay, that worked well. Now. What I am gonna grab is I'm going to grab my Bermuda Bay Blends. He said he wasn't even gonna swing it. That's awful. Hello, Teddy. Okay, so Bermuda Bay Blends. I'll say that 10 times fast. I'm gonna go to my dark end of my Bermuda Bay, blah, 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 those things, okay? And we're only gonna do alternating lines on this cake. We're gonna leave a little bit of white. I didn't on my one that I did the other day. and I didn't love how it turned out. Okay, so we're gonna go in there. I'm gonna get that. I'm not gonna go too far. Did I come pausing in my speech? Not gonna go too far. Hello from Newfoundland. Hi, Fran. Okay, just a sec. There we go. Okay, now we're gonna go to our lighter one here. And initially, all I'm doing, right, you see me do this before, we're just gonna go like that and fill it in. Don't get crazy here, okay? We don't need a ton of ink, so just get this in. And once this is in, we'll deal with that smoothing of that line, okay? 
Now you could do this with any color. I did it the first time without these white gaps in between and I just, I basically I kind of gave it too much ink. I'll show you it after. Okay, so you can see that now, yes? So you can kind of see why am I so happy you picked the stripes? I don't know, because it's a stripey day. Okay, so now I'm gonna go back to where those two lines overlapped and we are just simply going to go over it with our blends. And you can go over the dark part again too, it makes no difference. But just go over it until it kind of works it. Work it, own it. Yes, that's better, good. Okay, here. Doot, 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 work it in. Doot, doot. Okay, we're almost there. There, okay, so we got those cute little stripes. <gasps> Off to parent-teacher interviews, oh, good luck, Hannah. <laughs> Actually, I have to say, I love doing parent-teacher interviews. They're a lot of fun. And I love it when parents are all shocked. Are you sure you know who my kid is? I'm like, yeah, your kid's wonderful. Well, they're not at home. I'm like, that's because you have to love them and I don't. So they're easier for me. Okay, punch that guy out. Super cute little cake, okay? This, I feel like it's got like a buttercream frosting or something, yes? Okay, next thing we're gonna do is we are going to go to this guy and we're going to stamp our cake stand. Godspeed, uh, Anna. Okay, I'm looking for my, there it is, my scrub. My scrub, I think, I, this one's getting thrown through the washing machine tonight. I've been doing that, it kind of works wonderful. I just threw it in with my other laundry. Now if no ink comes off on anybody, it's kind of great. Okay, so we're gonna go like this. Now I have to pay attention, which way does it go into the punch? Okay, so we want it to slide into the punch. Yeah, like that. Okay. Now I want to see if this works because it worked really well with my um, rich Razzleberry ones. So I'm going to do just a hair of dark. Now I'm going to do the whole bottom dark. And you'll notice I'm doing, no, I'm not using Memento today. I'm just doing the same kind of tone on tone. What am I doing there? Oh, and light. Okay, I'm going to do that. And then here I'll do a little hair more of dark. There we go. Hello, Cassie. Okay, now we're going to go back to our light one and fill this in. Now we've talked about this again, so again, just fill it in. These two stripes I'm doing in light, I'm not worrying about them, so they're going to just get filled in. And then here, we're going to go like that. And then we're going to come down this guy here. Now I'm not putting barely any pressure on my blends because I don't need any extra ink to come out. I don't want it to bleed, so I'm just kinda, there we go, okay? Watching me live, work it, own it, don't go so far, because it sounds like a bad first day. Oh no, seriously. I think maybe he, he knows I'll come up with something, yes. He's like, just leave her, let her sink her own ship. She'll come up with something weird and obnoxious. Okay, so now, see what I'm doing? I'm just smoothing that out. Doop, 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 doop. Make the noise, it'll help. Helps with the smoothing. Oh, see, look at that shading. Someone commented on one of my videos the other day. I obviously had said in it, like, I am not an artist and I can use blends. So that tells you that anybody can do it. You guys, I'm serious. Anybody can do it. If I can do it, anyone can. There we go. Okay. Give us a little bit of a shadow on our little cake stand. Okay. You ready? Now, I feel like I want a bigger spot there for that. How are you, Nancy? Okay, now we're going to come in and we're going to punch this guy out. And I'm going to hope that this cake, there, got it? Okay, we're good. Now, next thing we're going to do, we can start to assemble, I think. Well, no, I have to stamp some sentiments, but that's okay. We can do that in a minute. Is that going to work? Oh yeah, you're going to work. So here's the deal. When I decided to do this one, I was like, but we don't have any Bermuda Bay ribbon. And so I, I totally use that whiny voice, just so you know. Um, and so I grabbed my sheer white ribbon, okay? And we've got this in a couple of colors, but definitely not in Bermuda Bay. Now watch this. I'm like, you're like, wow, you have a lot of that ribbon out. No, I don't. Look. <gasps> Look at that. What color is that? Oh, wait, it's Bermuda Bay. Fancy that. So I'm going to show you. Actually, there's a couple little spots here that I missed. So all you do is you take your blends. That'll dry out in a second. Not worried about it. And then all you do is you come in and you color it. And I didn't, I was like, okay, I probably shouldn't touch it because I'll probably end up with it all over my hands. You don't because it's alcohol based. It dries super quick. So we needed this. And so this is how I ended up getting 
Um, you guys staying in town? No, I'm not there right now. And so we've got this super cute Bermuda Bay ribbon. Now, you guys, you got to think about this. Like, oh, wait, I want Highland Heather ribbon, but I want it in a softer shade than the regular. Just so you know, the voices in my head say these things sometimes. So now, look at, oh, wait, I have it. Ha <laughs> ha, check that. So you want this ribbon. Oh, you could actually do some really kind of fun looking tie dyed ribbon. Yes, anyone else picking that up right now? Okay, focus, something shiny. Next thing we're gonna do is we are going to grab all those bits that we kind of pre-assembled. I am gonna grab from the stamp set, I want, just a sec, I want my little candles. I'm just gonna throw you on sideways even though you're not supposed to be. Now, where are, am I looking at them? I am, I'm looking at them. Do you ever do that? Do you ever stare at something directly in front of you? Hello, Trisha. Okay, there we go. And I'll go like this. Okay, so we're gonna grab this. Now for this, I am gonna use my memento because I don't want these in the color. And I really hope my hands don't have ink on them right now so I don't end up getting it places I don't want. I know, Trisha, it's not fun. It was really fun to kind of color and do your own. Okay, so we're inking this guy up in memento. Come in the top, how high, yeah-ish like this okay now for this I did grab um, my actual Bermuda Bay marker not my blend because I was going into a really tiny little thin area and I did not want to risk it um, running so just a sec holding my breath can't talk breathe chew and color in a line at the same time do 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 we go almost there don't fall asleep. Do you ever go cross-eyed when you're staring at something like that, trying to color? I almost thought this was an old one because you're doing the cake set again. No, I'm just obsessed with cake. Isn't that bad? I'm like, yay, cake, cake, and more cake. I think I have cake on the brain. Ooh, chocolate cake would be really good right now. Okay, so we've got that. Next thing we're gonna do is we are going to take a little bit of snail. I know yesterday was a cake bag. Today's a cake card. See what else I can come up with with cake. And we're gonna throw that one right onto there. Now, what we're gonna do next is we're gonna grab um, mini dimensionals for the cake stand because he's so kind of narrow in the top and in the base, right? So we'll go in here. We'll go like that. One and two. Pull that stuff off. And we're gonna put this one right down here at the bottom. Boop. Gotta make sure he's low enough that I don't cover up my cake when I go to put it on. Okay, and then we want a large dimensional on the cake. There we go. And we're gonna take this and we're gonna tuck it right boop, boop, over top of there. Okay, we got it. Now, I don't need my big shot plates. Don't know why that's in the... Okay, we need these, we need these. Now, I think right here I am gonna use... Do you like my little mini bow cake squirrel? Same thing, right? Um, so we're gonna use... My, and I do have a little bow maker here at the lake and it's just kind of, this was like a prototype one my husband had made, but we found that the ribbon doesn't slide off the wooden dowels as easy as it slides off of metal dowels. So he'd switched over in his little designs to go into a metal dowel. Now look, do you see? I have no blends on my finger after that. Yes, this is Bermuda Bay, okay? So Trisha, I just colored my, our white ribbon you can see there I even showed you with purple, but I colored it just with my blends marker. And I didn't press heavily, I'm not trying to wreck the marker. Look at that, woo woo, super cute. Okay, so I want that. Put away my little bow thing. Don't need it, put away my ribbon. Okay, next, I think I, think I picked this one because it was super cute. Found or caught, oh no, did I catch something? Who knows? I can't even, half the time I like can't remember what I said eight seconds ago when we were saying, and then you guys, by the time you get to see it, it's already moved past, and I'm like, I don't even remember what I just said. There we go, so we're gonna sneak in here, and we're gonna put some snail on the back of this guy, just so that we can get black. I didn't have a piece of black the right length, so I just decided to do this. Hello, Vicky. Okay, so we've got that one. Now we're going to come in, and this one is going to go on here. Now I am feeling the need to do a little trim. I can see a little bit of black over there, but I am not trimming it until it's on because I want it all to match up nice and clean. Okay, there we go. 
Okay, will you bear with me for 30 seconds? I'm just gonna go trim this. My trimmer's over here and I'm not bringing it into the picture because it is one of the big old Stampin' Up! guillotine ones that everybody will be jealous and not be happy with me. Okay, so this, uh, do I want to pop it up? No, nope, I'm not gonna pop it up. I'm gonna be careful. Joe, that's husband's name, just explain why it doesn't come off the wood dowels as well. And I'm confused. There's more friction, don't you think, Joe? You have a Joe? You're, I have a Joe too. I don't know if you knew this, Laura. My son's name is Joe. Um, yeah, less, is it just there's more friction with the wood? Help me out here, Joe. Not my Joe, it's okay. Okay, so we've got those. We're gonna pop those dimensionals off. We don't need them. Are you off? No. There you go. One, two, three, four. And we'll stick this one down on here. Now, the sentiments on this one are the part that cracked me up. Okay, so we're gonna put that cute little cake on. Hello, Susan in Brisbane. Okay, like that. And then I will show you because I did another one. You're jealous of my guillotine. I know it, but like it was so amazing. I feel like it's too much. It's too much um, for me to be in there. I'm going to end up changing that later. I know I will, but I'll, I'll post a picture later for you guys of how it turned out. Okay. I like that. I do like the ribbon. Okay. So because I feel like my cake, I'm just way too, I wonder if I did a black cake stand here. Squirrel. Let's pull this off. Anyone else feeling like it's just too much for me to bake? Even though I do love how the cake stand turned out, I feel like it's too, there we go. Smoother, you have a, yes, he says metal smoother, for sure. Yes, I have a Joe too. Do you want me to make you laugh? When I was, I'm looking for my black paper, so I'm not running away, well, kind of. Um, when I was pregnant with my second one and we didn't know what it was yet, what it was. Well, we knew it was a child. We had that much determined. Um, but we didn't know whether it was male or female. My mother cracks me up. My mother comes in. She's like, what about Mary? I'm like, what do you mean, mom? What about Mary? And she's like, what about Mary for a name if it's a girl? I'm like, mom, you really got to think that out in your head. I think I like that better. Is that okay? Please don't be mad. Which do you like better? I feel like, yeah, I got to break it up. Um, I was like, mom, you got to play that one out in your head. Because there is no way that I am going to have Mary and Joseph. That is a little bit odd. Anyway, she was like, oh, yeah, I never thought about that. Because we, we were just randomly throwing out the names. Better? Yes, thank you, Janice. I didn't even know you were on here, Janice. Black, love it. Good, okay. We fixed it. But we did really pretty coloring on that cake stand, don't you think? Okay, so we're going to come in. We're going to put you in. There we go. Now I want a glue dot. And we'll stick that just up at the top. And we're going to come in. Oops. I rolled it too much. Don't roll it. Oh, don't put it so far over to the side. There we go. Now we're going to come in here and we'll just push that one on just like that. Okay. So those, oh, good Lord, those glue dots come in handy. So sweet. Okay. Next thing. Yeah, I still, I don't even love that cake. I, I think I love my other cake better. Hmm. Do I do it again? Do I do my cake again? I'll show you. Just a second. Do you want to see the other card? Hello, Gloria. Here, we can decide. I, you, I'd have a Mary and Joseph because I'm cheeky. Oh. No, Diana, Stamp It Up doesn't carry fast views. So here is my other card that I did. Now, I liked that I had a little bit more color variation when I used my Rich Razzleberry. I feel like it really kind of blended, but well, whatever, breathe. Okay, not you, me, because you guys are all fine. I'm the one with the issues here. Now, we're going to go with the cake is the answer. Who cares what the question is? Because seriously, it's so true. Where is, I gotta find the cake as the answer and I can never read these things backwards. I could just flip the package over and see it. What if you move the bow to the narrower part of the cake stand? You want me to take it down here? Okay, hang on. Can do that. Whoops, sorry, hardly just heard hubby on the deck. Okay, you want me to put, oh, I like it better. Woo, woo, thank you. I think it breaks up how, um, kind of plain the cake stand is right now. Okay, we'll put our Bermuda Bay bow on our cakes. I feel like it needs to be a bit smaller, but that's okay. There, go like that, shake it off. Okay, it's, hello Scarlett, it's a cake for breakfast kind of day. It's a cake all day long kind of day, Cor. Okay, 
So we're gonna go with this. And we are going to get a piece of, I've just got a piece of Whisper Right. Is this the one I wanted? I feel like I had another one, right? I did. There we go. So we're gonna take this one here. I'm gonna stamp this right down at the edge. I know, do you love how it takes, like I need 35 of you though to help me put the card together? Cause I always change, oh, change my mind. Okay, hang on, I gotta, yeah, we gotta cheat. We're gonna go like this. Whoa, don't stick your, <gasps> look at that. See, this is why you close your ink pads, team. Don't do what I do, do as I say. Okay, so we're gonna come up here and I'm gonna stamp cake is the answer. And I know it's upside down, I'm doing it upside down on purpose. Scarlet, you know me, cake is the answer, right? no matter what the question is. Okay, so we've got that one. So we're gonna do a little cake as the answer. Now I'm gonna trim this off, so give me a sec. Let's see if I cut it thin enough. I did, ha ha. So we've got this one right here, and it says, cake is the answer. Oh yes, you are cute. And then we want a no matter what the question is. Now do you feel like I should have stamped that in black? Okay, you guys hum and haw over that while I do the other one. Currently cheering cake over here. You're cheering cake or are you sharing cake? What are you doing? Scarlet, oh yes, she says. Okay, so hang on. Come like this. Do a little bit of it. Oh, I didn't leave the paper. I didn't bring the paper back. Why would I bring the paper back? Because I need the paper. Okay, nobody's answering me. I need to know what color you think that that cake is the answer part should be. Or should this be in Bermuda Bay? Let's check. Okay. Peter Watson. Hello, Peter Watson. Yes, you like that. Okay, so hang on. We're going to come in here, and I am going to use... No, not like that. I'm going to go it this way. I need to cut with my right hand on the side of it, because then I can get it straight. This is like a skill. There. Okay, so we've got the bits. We've got hola, Peter. Okay, so we have got cake is the answer. Who cares what the question is? We're going to put these both on. So cake is the answer. You're going foop, foop. Okay. And then you, yep. Yeah. I'm going to match the lines. Okay, hang on. One. Oh, no. I can't, I can't cut upside down. I have to make them match. There, okay. I'm not really upside down. I don't know why I say that. Uh, where are we going? I think we might need to go up here. Okay, can you guys decide where we're putting that? So we've got cake is the answer, who care? I feel like that kind of disappears on the white. It does disappear, doesn't it? Okay, keep playing. Come up with something else for me. Because right now I'm just going to put rhinestones on because I don't know what to do. I'm lost. Use Wink of Stella on the cake to have bling. Okay, now, Diana, I would absolutely, my only fear, just a second, you might see it all go, is because we've already got um, the blends and quite a bit of ink. I don't want it to run. Okay, so we'll go over like this. Add a little sparkle to our cake and I'm going very lightly. I don't want to add a ton of glitter to that. Up, up, you all say up. Top for sentiments, okay. But do you think it's on the right color paper? I feel like it might not be. I feel like we might need possibly Bermuda Bay paper with black ink. Can it go on an angle? What, yeah, yeah, see I can't do this. I'm still leaving it until you guys come up with something. What if you do a skinny strip of Bermuda Bay behind the sentiment? I like it. Good. Thank you. Because honestly, there's not a lot going on upstairs in my head today. Okay, just a second. Grabbing us a little strip of Bermuda Bay. Okay. So, we have got... Now, what if we do it? Just a second. Tell me what you think of this. We're not in any rush. No one has to be anywhere, do you? Bermuda Bay with black ink. Okay, we've also got that. Okay, so let's try both of these options. So we've got this, and if you take it, and we'll stick it down, and then we'll take this, and we'll make... Oh, I don't want to do that. I'm going to cut here. There. Like that, so you could do it like that. Cake is the answer. Yep, or let's see, 
I go to more Bermuda Bay. Where is it? I really should have done this card first so that I knew what I was doing. I'm not loving it. It's really, it's not getting me this card, you guys. I think it came out way better in this one, but that's okay. Do, 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 do. I'm needing a card like this for my kid class. Oh, I know, but we have no idea what the final result is yet, Jill. We're kind of playing with this and going, yeah, I don't like that. Don't like that. Hang on, I can't see. My eyes are playing. My eyes get me on the bottom of my little um, bevel, like the bevel on the edge of this one. Okay, so we've got cake as the answer. Just a second, let's chop this one off and see if this works. Okay, we're gonna have a lot of little sentiments ready to go for this card. Oh, I didn't cut it properly, but. Well, I feel like that might be better with black. What do you think? What if we did that? Okay, so hang on, so let's go like that. I like that. I still like it up. Okay, I'm needing a card. Oh, sorry, that was Jill's comment. I already saw that one. Just checking. Sorry, there. Okay, so what if we took this up and then gave it a little bit of a black layer? And then we've got a whole bunch of things we can choose from. Okay, so for my black, I need this piece of black. Oh, no, it's gray. It's got to be a piece of black here. Where's the black? Give me a sec. So now if we took the black, I don't know I would, if I would give the kids my blends. No, but they could totally do that with markers, don't you think? I think you could pull it with markers. Jill Ray, we're having, we're having a design flaw issues. We're just trying to figure out how to finish this card, and we can't. Or I can't. Because it's not your responsibility to do that. It's mine. I just am not having a full brain. Okay, here, hang on. This one we're going to come in. Go like that. Oh, that's better. Okay. Yeah, we definitely needed that up there. Now, cake is the answer. We could put this one down low. Who cares what the question? Okay, so hang on, let's take this. Do you guys like that color? You love that. I do love it. I didn't, I was so disappointed when it was on back order. I don't necessarily love the card I'm making today, but I like this one better. This top guy. Here, now we're way out of the screen. That's it? Okay, good. Thank you, Kathleen. Oh. Okay, so cake. Should he overlap or can he go up top? Cake is the answer. And then I feel like this might also, you guys might need to be on Bermuda Bay too or might need a, uh, tell me, who cares what the question is? So I'm gonna figure out the who cares what the question is part. Okay, so we could do it here. We could do it here, but I feel like if it's here, well, it could be white. It could just kind of be hiding down there. You could put the sentiment on the inside. Cake is the answer. I think the cards are adorable. Well, you're really sweet. Hello, Julie Walsh. I mean, we could put that inside and just say, who cares what the question is? But I feel like I want it down here. Can we stick it there? On Bermuda, but the other, but the other sentiment used the Bermuda Bay behind. Okay, so let's try, you were saying go like this. Let's peel this off. Let's take this, stick that, whoa. You have to actually put, just so you know, things don't stick together unless you put snail first. White on Bermuda Bay on the lower side. Okay, look at this. See? Woo, woo. Thank God for you guys tonight because there would not have been a finished card if it were on me. There. I got a little bit of adhesive. Oh, don't look. Because people get super cheese because we don't carry these anymore. But it's like my best friend. There. And then on here, I feel like I didn't put it on straight. You wish? Hang on, she said, I'm so indecisive today. Okay, core, really? Look at me. I'm like, I don't even know what card I'm making. <laughs> okay, let's go like this. I'll put you down. There, that's better. Oh, that was stressing me out. One. And then let's take you. Now you got to pull up this side here. Sorry, because I want to cut this one underneath. There, there, now I feel like this is too wide. We're doing like, this is like surgery today, you guys. With ribbon scissors, shh. 
You can get them at the dollar store. I know it doesn't stick with that adhesive. There we go. That's cute. Okay. So now we need to put this ink out of the way because let's be serious. I'm going to stick my arm in it any second now. Boop. And boop. If you and I were together, we would, Corey, you had to so true. Be like, okay, screw the card. We're going to eat cake. Let's eat cake. Okay. Now this, okay, just decide here. Do you want it up here or do you want it down here? I feel like it should be here. Vote for upper or lower, upper or lower, upper or lower. Joe said, give the super cheesed people super wine. Total. Okay, cheese and wine, wine and cheese. Come on, work with me. Where are we going? Down. I'm waiting. I'm lower, lower, like down here, low. Go lower, lower. Okay, good. So we're going down here, down there, right? That was where we said, not up here, on here. Make it, okay, I'm going to make the green. There. What do you think? I think we did it. Oh, we're all good. Okay. Do you want lower than that still? Are we still saying lower? 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 Do you mean lower than where I currently am? Yes. No, maybe. Put the white on the black. Okay. I think that's where I am. Put the whites on the black. Does that work with you? On the lower right white. Come even lower than where I currently am. Okay. Look at this. I can't. Oh no. I can. I can do anything. Do you like my positive self-talk? Because that's totally going to help right now. Okay, we're going to take the white to the edge of the black. And we're going to go like that. Ha! We made it! Thank goodness. Yeah. Oh, no, Pamela's saying no. Oh, no, Pamela. What did I do? Okay, we're calling it because this card is going to make me crazy. I totally thought this card was going to turn out different when I started, and it didn't. So you can see two cute little ones there. Um, I have to admit, I do like the look of that. Here, I'm going to pull it up to you so you can see the rich razzleberry cake. I really want to eat the rich razzleberry cake, yes? Don't want to eat my Bermuda Bay cake as much. No, actually, a bit lower on the white, like on the white, on the white. Hang on. We can do that. She's saying go down here on the white. On the way there okay we stuck it on the weight on the way it's the bow the bow is too big does it bother anyone else or is it just me tonight are you guys gonna seriously are you just gonna like lose it with me any second now and now i don't have any more ribbon okay so this is the only problem when you have a bow maker is okay you could just laugh at me and you can go right now i'm so sorry i i did not think i would be so indecisive um you can't undo a bow maker bow the way you normally would. So uh, you have to kind of get it open differently. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna move my pins one closer and now I'm gonna do it. I feel like my bow was a little bit overpowering. Do a knot on the ribbon. I could totally do a knot on the ribbon. Are you just laughing at me now? Just a sec, I got it. There. Fat fingers, work with me, work with me. Give me a cute bow, slide up. Yes, that will work. Okay, now we need to put another glue dot down because I've you know, used 97 on the same piece of cake at this point. No, you can't just pull the ends on those. I know, isn't that crazy, Nancy? It doesn't, a bow maker bow doesn't work that way because it's not tied like a normal bow. There we go. Okay, now, oh, this is better, watch this. Let's give it a haircut. Give it a haircut. Make it all. That's better. Now it doesn't look so big and overpowering. The big bow is getting in the way. Yay, I'm seeing you live. Oh, good Lord, Trish. This was hysterical. This was like Angela's indecisive. I can't do anything on my own. Please make decisions for me. I can't use my brain. Yeah, it is. Isn't that funny, Janice? The bow just stood out. It was too big to me. So there you go, my dears. Thank you for all of your help in getting through this card today. That was a riot. I hope you have an amazing evening and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.